there will be candidates in all counties that we will be organizing now. Uh, where, uh, which post they will be seeking is another thing to be decided later. We will have candidates simply because <clears throat> this is one of the best ways that an educational campaign can be brought before the public to tell them about the issues of the day, to tell them about what the Leader Party intends to do and is, and also to be able to present to them in the form of a, a uh, person somebody who can represent you know, real change. In other words, the opportunity and hope for, for real change to come about. Finding disposal sites that are compatible with the adjacent land use and at the same time are not, are not so far removed from the urban area that it makes cost impractical. Do you have some types of disposal that give you more problems than others? Well, I think uh, our disposal uh, system that's predominant in this part of the country is a sanitary landfill. Uh, we will probably see very little incineration in this part of the country, in my opinion, in the next few years. We will continue to rely on the sanitary landfill as our major source of disposal uh, for the next few years. What about other uses, such as, as the proposal to make building blocks this type of thing? Uh, this will be touched upon in the study. Our, our main objective here is to minimize the cost to the local governments for solid waste disposal. Now, after we begin to look at this as a joint venture, as a cooperative endeavor, then we begin to centralize solid waste disposal. This then will permit more investigations to be made as for possible recycling or other uses of solid waste other than just simply disposal. I think so. I mean, this is the time of the year. In the last three or four ball games, I wouldn't say that I have played um, in an all-star uh, category. I've not, as far as scoring goes, I, I haven't scored as well as I have been scoring prior to, uh, let's say, this past week. Um, but I have been contributing in other areas, so I would think that uh, I, I'm playing playing as well as I've played in the last two or three years. Interestingly enough, the uh, starting the other starting guard last year happened to be Donnie Freeman, and he was chosen too. And Donnie's absence, would you say a few words on his behalf? Well, he's an all-star. I mean, he's been an all-star ever since he's been in the league. And in the past uh, 10 games or so, he's really, really gotten himself back into shape and he's playing uh, up to his capabilities. And I think uh, being out earlier in the season and having congenital anemia uh, really had an effect on him. He, wasn't, he was playing very, very sluggish, and uh, it took him a while to get back to all-star form, but he's really been playing quite well, and uh, I, he deserves the honor. This is the first time in 10 years 
that there has been a recorded decrease in crime one year over the preceding year and the seventh time in the last 25 years that this has happened in the city of Dallas. At the same time, our clearance rate uh, jumped up to about 27% in 1971 when compared with about 22% for 1970, and we had a, a very significant increase in the number of cases that we were able to clear, and there was a significant decrease in the number of major crimes reported to the Dallas Police Department. As I said, I have been personally disturbed, and I hope that I would never be a part of a body where we would have, uh, and if this is not political implications, and I, I stand corrected, but in my opinion, some things happening here which are leading toward that. Uh, I don't like it. I would not want to be a part of it. I don't appreciate the fact that the, I personally was eliminated from place four without ever being consulted and advised why. Uh, I was being considered to be removed, or if I minded, and uh, the other charges, which were elementary and premature, I'm not in favor of. These children basically are not wanted to begin with. Now, uh, I have to modify that statement too, because if we if we say unwanted on the basis of what a parent says, uh, on the surface, this is not true either. Uh, many people feel uh, that uh, people who abuse their children frequently have been have themselves been abused in childhood. So I do not accept this as anything that I have done, but certainly as a vote of confidence in the work that our total school family has done. We will say that there's not another, not another position in education in the nation that we would prefer to be in. We are focusing upon developing a center which will be used for the full treatment of parents and children plus research. Unfortunately, at this time, uh, the courts are all too quick to ask for criminal prosecution of parents who, pros who abuse children, which results in nothing whatsoever, either for the child or for the parent. Uh, it does permit us to revenge ourselves upon people and release our hostilities. If that has some social value, that's what we're doing. I understand it takes.